The only way for him to not die right now is defilers. I'm gonna have plus three as I hit the sunks. Hobo Terran donated three dollars, I see, it's a great thing we were able to watch this crazy Terran, no rush 15 minutes, I see it works as long you and your opponent never fucking touch each other, I mean what do you think this is high school prom? You can get closer to each other. <laughs> Chief cheered. X300, Lamau remember when Artie was like yo check out this build I've literally never tried before. And doubters were all ha ha yes do it believers in shambles we smoke cocks oh, lol wow literally <laughs> can't stop gobbling those yummy cocks oh no we lost someone get me a cock. Remember that, chat? I remember. Good times. Come on. The guy was 1700, like he could have done anything and he was gonna die. The only thing that could have been scary was Guardian Rush. Anyways, that's, that's... That was my first time doing Crazy Terran, and I was 30 seconds off. No, nah, Lurker, you're fine against Lurker. You're teching up really quickly, so you can get siege tanks if you need. Like, you can you can bend the build around based on what you're scanning. What makes this build bad, exactly? I don't, I don't think it's going to be an actually good build, because you're not actually doing much. You're mostly just sitting there getting the upgrades really quickly, and... Terran scales well with upgrades, but not as well as Ultras scale with upgrades, so I don't... It's not like with Crazy Zerg, as soon as you get plus two carapace on Ultras, you have this gigantic power spike. 2-1 is great on Marines, but it's not a gigantic power spike. Like if they go to Filer or Lurker, or anything, right? That's not exactly what he was doing. Like I have an upgrade advantage, and maybe I'm just okay, but, you know... <laughs> 